5 cardiac parasites to avoid Many parasites can be linked to heart disease, and some can seriously disrupt normal cardiac function. Parasitic infections in humans can lead to myocarditis, a disease that causes heart tissue inflammation. Parasites can also cause pericarditis, an inflammation of the membrane around the heart, and cardiomyopathy, which is a disorder that impedes pumping and can lead to heart failure. Toxoplasma gondii a microscopic organism called Toxoplasma gondii is responsible for the disease known as toxoplasmosis. It can be transmitted to humans through contact with cats, and may affect up to 2 billion people worldwide. Most develop no symptoms at all. Cats, are the only known definitive hosts in which the parasite may undergo sexual reproduction. In humans, T. gondii is one of the most common parasites in developed countries. T. gondii can persist in heart muscle, where it forms tissue cysts that can remain through the host's lifetime. Heart disease can be linked with chronic infection of T. gondii. The highest prevalence of persons infected is believed to be in France, at 84%. Although mild, flu-like symptoms occasionally occur during the first few weeks following exposure, infection with T. gondii produces no readily observable symptoms in healthy human adults. Basic food handling safety practices can prevent or reduce the chances of becoming infected with T. gondii, such as washing fruits and vegetables, and avoiding raw or undercooked meat, poultry, and seafood. Oocysts in cat feces take at least a day to sporulate and become infectious after they are shed. Dispose of cat litter daily to greatly reduce the chance of infectious oocysts being present in litter. As infectious oocysts from cat feces can spread and survive in the environment for months, you should always wear gloves when gardening or working with soil. Entamoeba histolytica This parasite is the primary cause for amoebiasis, or amoebic dysentery, a colon infection marked by abdominal pain and diarrhea. But in some cases, this parasitic infection can lead to a serious heart complication known as amoebic pericarditis, in which it causes abscesses in the pericardium, the sac-like membrane surrounding the heart. People with pericarditis often experience sharp, stabbing chest pain caused by the irritated pericardium walls rubbing against each other. The infection can occur when a person puts anything into their mouth that has touched the feces of a person who is infected with E. histolytica, swallows something, such as water or food, that is contaminated, or swallows cysts picked up from contaminated surfaces or fingers. Poor sanitary conditions are known to increase the risk of contracting amoebiasis E. histolytica. Trichinella spirales Trichinella spirales is an viviparous nematode parasite, occurring in rodents, pigs, bears, hyenas and humans, and is responsible for the disease trichinosis. It infects people who eat the undercooked meat of infected animals, entering the human hosts as larvae-filled cysts. After a host swallows the cysts, stomach acid dissolves the sac and releases the larvae into the body, eventually they circulate into the blood and burrow into muscles and brain tissue. Severe complications from the parasite can include heart tissue inflammation and life-threatening arrhythmia, or irregular heartbeat. The migration of adult worms in the intestinal epithelium can cause traumatic damage to the host tissue, and the waste products they excrete can provoke an immunological reaction. The first symptoms may appear between 12 hours and 2 days after ingestion of infected meat. Echinococcus granulosis Echinococcus granulosis, also called the hydatid worm, hyper tapeworm or dog tapeworm. Tapeworms in the Echinococcus genus can infect people when their eggs are ingested after contact with feces from a dog or other canids. The eggs hatch and the six hooked embryos cross the intestinal wall and travel to organs to form cysts. E. granulosis requires two host types, a definitive host and an intermediate host. The definitive host of this parasite are dogs and the intermediate host are most commonly sheep, however, cattle, horses, pigs, goats, camels and humans are also potential intermediate hosts. 
Cardiac cysts are rare, but can lead to irregular heartbeat, accumulation of fluid in the sac surrounding the heart, fainting due to high blood pressure, heart attacks and even sudden cardiac arrest. Trypanosoma cruzi Trypanosomiasis, or Chagas disease, is caused by the parasite Trypanosoma cruzi, and is transmitted to people through bites from insect vectors. Trypanosoma cruzi is a species of parasitic euglenoids. Amongst the protozoa, the trypanosomes characteristically bore tissue in another organism and feed on blood primarily and also lymph. Up to 40% of people infected by T. cruzi develop heart complications associated with chronic Chagas disease, such as heart rhythm abnormalities, a dilated heart that doesn't pump blood effectively, and congestive heart failure. In many cases, symptoms can appear 10 to 30 years after the victim was first infected, and can affect internal organs like, the heart, the esophagus, the colon, and the peripheral nervous system. Affected people may also die from heart failure. The incubation period is 5 to 14 days after a host comes in contact with feces. Chagas disease undergoes two phases, the acute and the chronic phase. The acute phase can last from two weeks to two months but can go unnoticed because symptoms are minor and short-lived. Symptoms of the acute phase include swelling, fever, fatigue, and diarrhea. The chronic phase causes digestive problems, constipation, heart failure, and pain in the abdomen. <laughs> 